New International Long Star American Truck Simulator. Let's fire her up. Hit turn the key on. We'll see how this truck is. We'll run by the repair shop. We'll take a look at all of this stuff for it, and then we will um, get a load. Now, the repair shop, when I was there, the camera was messed up and couldn't look around the truck. You could only see the front of it. So we're going to go back and check it out and uh, see. Yeah, that would be the closest one. Let's see, actually, you know what? While we're here, I want to attach the trailer to the truck. Um, there we go. Pretty quiet truck. And we're off. To the repair shop. about this truck is about 250,000 that's what I paid for it that's a 605 horsepower Cummins in it with a 13 speed for well, the retarder Jake breaks pretty quiet on it Feels like it's a rattling or something.
Hold on, we're taking that curve fast. Got the little switch on the dash down there for Jake break, light comes on and off. That's pretty cool. I like that. I like that a lot. The repair shot should be right up here on the right, according to the SPG. GPS, I mean. Uh-oh. Should be right here. this door right here we can park here and I'll take care of it Figure out where the hell this thing's at. Yeah, so you can't, for some reason, it won't let me. That's just it. The camera just does that. It won't go around. To the side, you can't see the side of the truck. Anyway, I got to paint, fix the paint job on it. To the company colors. Let's see. Let's see, that's supposed to be dark blue. Light blue. And green. Or is it red? Let's go with red. We got black. So you got a lot of choices here, six by four, six by twos, 280 gallon tanks, you got 240 tanks, 260 tanks, 100 gallon tanks, 20 gallon tanks, so on, so on, so on. For the engines, we got the Cummins ISX and the Cummins X15, ISX15, we got 600 horsepower, 
605 horsepower, 565, so on, so on, so on, so on. For the shifting, we got different transmissions. Now I got mods on, so you might not have all these. I don't know. But anyway, here we are. We're running a 13 speed with a 3.56 differential with a retarder. There's the inside view. You got three different choices from the dash. You got the diamond black cherry. We got the diamond dash. We got the classic. I like the black cherry. Looks good. As far as the paint jobs go, got plenty of paint jobs here to choose from. Can't see the side of the truck, so there's no point in really going through them all. But anyway, there's the paint jobs. On the outside, you got all different kinds of things. You can add your bean kittens. You got three different visors, or you can take off the visor if you want to. Of course, you got your name plates that you can add. You got your hood, which is only one. You got your grill, which you only have one of. You got the option to have little uh, mirrors or no mirrors. You can add your flags to here if you're going to be doing a heavy haul. You can do click down on the bottom here. We got our oversized flag, which is required by the DOT. And here we got a bumper. We got a bumper, regular bumper, and a bumper with a sensor in it. I don't know what the hell the sensor means, but okay. Um, you got your choices of your air cleaners. Let me kind of move over here as far as we can. Um, if I click the right ones here. Okay, here's your door locks. You have chrome door locks, just like all the other trucks. The standard. Here's your air cleaners. You got chrome air cleaners with lights, without lights, and then oh well, that has lights. That has little like um, what do they call them? Flare lights. There you go. And you have no lights on it. Now your options for your wheels. You got your wheels, whatever mod you have. Of course, you got your rims, whatever mods like the all other trucks. Um. You get an option to have the little mirror or not have the side mirror. I prefer the little mirror. It gives me a good look over here at the blind spot. So it helps me drive and I won't run into anybody. Um, as far as that goes, that's basically it. You can't change the stacks. You only get the the the, the, the stacks that come with it. Um, for the side skirts, you can, have, uh, you can have one with lights or without lights. Of course, we can't see it. So we have no idea what it really looks like. Um, and then we have, come on, there we go, we have our tanks, we have aluminum tanks or chrome tanks, of course we want chrome tanks because we want shit to be shine, but you put out, but you, we want the shit to be shiny, we want it to be shiny, so we're going to go with the chrome tanks, good god, why is that so hard for me to say, oh, and of course, you got your, you don't have a choice of a CB radio or anything like that in here. Basically, you don't have nothing to do with none of this. You can add on your steering wheel. You can have your different steering wheels, whichever ones you want. If you're an outlaw, you can get you a steering wheel with some guns on it. Like that, if you're feeling Billy really Badass, I just like this one. I usually go with either this one or the classic one. Where's that? Um, right here. This one. I like those two the best. These are all right. I got this one in my Bobo, I do believe, but they're all right. And of course, you can have your little uh, slob knobs here to you help you turn your steering wheels. If you have any, I don't have any, so we're screwed on that part. It's not really a big important thing for me. They're kind of illegal anyway. Most truck companies don't like it, so whatever. Um, and that's basically it. So there you go. There's your freight line, or freight line. There's your international Longstar. No. God dang it. Mirrors, of course, you can have chrome mirrors and the regular black mirrors. <coughs> there is no option to take the mirrors completely off, so you can't do that.
And I didn't get my paint job. Damn it, son of a goat chop looking. Okay, we're just gonna go without the paint job. We'll get that some other time. That ain't no big deal. I'm not gonna sit there and mess with it. Um, now we're gonna go down to Cargo Market. We're in Portland. Let's go over here to route length, shortest routes. Go ahead and haul some pipe. 60,000 pound. Oh, shoo. Almost had a heart attack. Me, personally, I don't really mind to look at these. I mean, I don't like it, but I don't hate it either, so I'm kind of, like, neutral on them. Um, as far as the real life, if I was to ever buy one, oh, I might. I don't know. If the price was right, I probably would. But that'd probably be, like, the only time. Um, I mean, it looks okay. I mean, it's just, I don't know. Yeah. Damn, it got some brakes on it, doesn't it? Got some road noise to it, doesn't it?
We're governed at 65, we can't go over 65. So. Sixty five is fast enough anyway. I got to take a break on, you can barely hear it. I mean, it's quiet. It is on, yeah, the lights on. I don't know what the hell's rattling, but damn. To put some tape on the dash or something, something's Take his exit. Nope. That exit goes nowhere. Figure out what button and set to change the dash display. Dumb seven. No shifting while you're turning.
Yeah, see, there's a little trailer bike all over. Good old Port of Portland. Working hard or hardly working. flatbed so we don't have to worry about back into the dock. coming out this way I'm not gonna go the other way we're just gonna say and wait for light change that way we ain't on the tracks Exactly. That's what I meant. I don't know what the deal is with the blinker light right there. What the hell's going on with that? On the front. to turn right anyway so I'll well, just get over this lane now five miles a gallon So far, not too bad. I'm really driving it. My favorite's the Freightliner Cascadia. That thing's nice to drive. 
just looks good, feels good. That in the boat wall. Oh hell. Come on. There ain't no cars here, just see if we gotta get over. Got a car over there. There it goes, it's out of blind spot. Tenth gear, eleventh gear, fifty mile an hour, speed limit's fifty five. Got a car coming around us. Nothing on that side, there's a bridge. Car's still there. Doing 58 mile an hour, go ahead and shift to 12th and let off and let it coast a little. All right, we're gonna get over the right lane, check our mirror, don't see anything clear. Blink her off. I'm gonna go ahead and get over one more time. I don't see no more cars there, so we'll go ahead and do curve coming up. So we're gonna use the engine brake. Slow down, downshift. Okay, continue through the curve. The trailer and load still there. Trailer's not sliding sideways. We're good there. Okay, straighten out. Engine brake off. Give us some gas. Move over to the other lane. Check the mirror. Make sure it's clear. There's nothing there. We're good to go. Blinker off. We're at 57 mile an hour, 11th gear, 1700 RPM, go ahead and shift into the 12th, speed limit's 55, we're doing 56, we've got to exit up ahead, Speed limit still 55, we're doing 54, we're in 12th gear, 1400 RPM. Speed limit is 50. We're downshift in 11th gear, 1500 RPM, 48 mile an hour. We can go around a curve. The like RPMs are 12, 41 mile an hour, 11th gear. Check our mirror, make sure there's nothing there. We're gonna merge right, left. The I 5 Seattle. And we need that exit, so we're gonna check our mirror. Back over into that lane. Should just stay over here. Uh, 48 mile an hour. Let's go ahead and slow down a little bit. Downshift, 10th, 44, 15, climbing a hill. Watch our RPMs, there's cars passing us. 1200 downshift, 1200 downshift. We're in eighth gear, we're at 1200, 11 and a half. Just leave it there, downshift one more time. There we go. 1400, 1500, 25 mile an hour, 7th gear, shift, check, cars coming around us, go ahead and double shift on that one, starting to climb a hill, um, speed's going to slow down, we're at 45, speed limit's 50, got a line of cars trying to pass us, go ahead and shift, 1700 RPM, we're at 52 mile an hour, let off of 1500 RPM, 11th gear. Car's still coming around, got to exit up ahead. Uh, 30 west, exit. Check GPS, yep, we need to take that exit.
cars there. Still nothing over there, nothing hanging off, we're good. Still got fuel and everything, don't have no lights on, no warning. Good, now we're going to turn, uh, check our mirror, got a car over there. Trailer's not sliding, we're good. Now we gotta go ahead and merge to the left, so we're gonna put our blinker on. And we're gonna merge over, slow down so we can get off that truck's ass. Um, go ahead and merge on over, blinker off. 11th gear, 50 mile an hour. Go ahead and put the engine brake on. We got a stop sign, stop light coming up. So we're gonna go ahead and get in this lane because I think we got our turn. Go ahead and downshift, downshift. Engine brake is on still, downshift. Oh shit. Oh shift. Hold on. We're having technical difficulties here. We gotta be in another lane anyway. Make a wide turn. Coming in. Ooh. Let's stop by there on the way out. It's my scream. Ice cream, you scream, all scream for ice cream. Okay, we've got to make a left turn here. So we're going to stop. Cross traffic does not stop. We've got a blind spot. We've got a brick wall right there, actually. We gotta have back up. We have to back up. There's nothing behind us yet. Okay, go ahead and put our four ways off. Blinkers on. We're gonna wait for traffic to clear before we turn. Put it in gear. That usually helps. We'll go ahead with second. Good, we're clear, not gonna hit the fence. Let's swing it out wide. We're gonna swing it back around. And turn the engine brake off. Straighten it up. There we go. Engine off. And turn the lights off. We don't need those on. Loads delivered. So that's their international pro or international long star. Um, hope you enjoyed the video. Like, subscribe, share. American Truck Simulator. Awesome game. Get it. Play it. You can get all the uh, whole bundle for um, nine dollars and fifty cents right now on Steam. It's good until uh, December the eighteenth of two thousand nineteen. So hope you guys have a wonderful day, and I'll see you in the next video.